So in this video, I'm going to be showing you, or a patient's going to be demonstrating a double bubble effect. You can see from her pictures before she starts contracting that she has a fold on the underneath of uh, both sides. This is called a double bubble effect, and this occurs when the implants are normally placed behind the muscle, the muscle holds them up, and then the breast tissue sags over it, droops over the old fo fold, giving you a double bubble effect. And because the muscles holding the implant up, you get the implant in a high position. And you can see our patient is pushing in with her hands, and you can see how the double bubble fold gets worse. So she pushes in, she contracts her pectoralis major muscles, and that squashes and lifts the implants up, making the um, fold much worse. Now the solution to that in the vast majority of cases is either to release the muscle, um, redu that reduces the pull that our patient was demonstrating there, or alternatively move the implants in from behind the muscle to in front of the muscle, and that has the same effect of reducing the uh, pectoralis major pull on the muscle. So in summary, double bubble, relatively common, um, I see it, we see it quite a lot. It is correctable if you feel you do have excess contraction of the muscle following a breast enlargement. Um, please come and see us and we'll be delighted to discuss the options with you.